Kendi, just keep off that leg for now, okay? Thank you. I need to go get a phone, okay? Because I have to call Maxie. I don't even know what she's thinking with me. I don't know. Yes, you absolutely have to tell him what's going on. Thank you, Nathan. She'll take care of the patient since she's done with the well. Elizabeth, I'm glad you're here. I need to speak with you too about Miss Prescott. Yeah. We'll need to wait in here until detectives can question you. I'll be right back. What happened last night? Are you were nervous about going out with Franco. <laughs> yeah. Did you go? I did. When I did it was um it was a first date to remember. It ended with Franco being hauled off as a person of interest in the murder of Miss Prescott, which makes him a suspect in all the other hospital killings. Well, we call them the blueberry muffins, but as far as the coffee goes, it's Corinthos. So don't get me started. Like a full service attorney breakfast and we work like. Are, are you kidding me? There's nothing funny about this. They're about to throw the book at you for all those hospital murders, not to mention the failed attempt on Lucas Jones's life. You have no alibi. They saw you coming out of the latest victim's room. Doesn't mean I saw them. They are about to get a search warrant, and they're going to search your apartment and your art studio. They can't do that. Yes, they can do that. And if they find anything more incriminating than the sketches of the dead people. Oh, no. They found those. Yeah, they did in your art therapy room at the hospital. But that's inadmissible, right? Because they didn't have a warrant. So that, that's just like fruit of the poison tree. They don't need a warrant. It's hospital property. Yeah. Uh, I guess that makes sense. Are they going to find anything that's going to bury you deeper 